WWE Diva here in Hollywood, getting ready to speak to the wonderful cast of Yes Men. But first, I thought I'd take a ride on this scooter that was in the movie. Jim Carrey actually wore this helmet, so if it's good enough for him, then it's uh, good enough for me. Yeah, no. No, no. No, no. You're always making excuses. No. When's the last time you did anything fun? Hi. Hello, Layla here with the star of the movie, Yes Man, the wonderful Jim Carrey. That's right, I'm here for you. I'm going to get to you. You know I'm coming to get you. I'm on you, baby. Jim, lovely to meet you. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Could you drop kick me right now? I could. Would you? Say yes to life. <laughs> <laughs> Can you please tell me a little bit about Yes Man the movie? Yes Man is it's kind of like my comedy side uh, meets my self-help side. And it has crashed into the middle like two waves smashing into each other on a romantic beach. Yes Man is a movie about a guy whose life is in a rut. And he needs something to shake it up. So he embarks on this yes philosophy. We're going to make a covenant. basically means you have to say yes to any opportunity that presents itself in your life. Can I borrow a couple of bucks? Are we going to fight or what? Would you like to throw loose your bridal shower? Yeah. Sure. So the movie's really about the weird areas his life goes into and the unexpected things that happen. It really is just a balls out funny movie. Seriously, your balls will be out at the end of this movie. <laughs> and it's really a funny movie. But it also is about engaging in life. The world's a playground, but somewhere along the way, everyone forgets it. So, Zoe, in Yes Man, you play a very positive role. Why do you think WWE Universe would enjoy this movie? If you're interested in all of these characters and the sort of daredevil attitude of WWE, I think you'll like this movie where an ordinary man starts saying yes to everything and ends up doing extreme sports and riding on motorcycles. Perhaps they might see a bridge between their lives and the WWE. I love the bar fight scene. If Carl could have any WWE superstar in his corner, who would you choose? Oh, The Undertaker. Really? Oh, yeah. He's going to Crush, win kill, destroy. Yeah, he's going to Crush, win that. kill, destroy. <laughs> you know, Andre the Giant, that's what we're talking about, oh, classics. Wow. I loved Andre the Giant. Picking two great guys. Absolutely. Well, I like John. I like oh, John Cena. Yeah. You can't see me. Hi, Danny. Hi, Bradley. Nice Hi. to meet you. Hey. Say Where's you guys have a match against me tomorrow night. You win. Okay? Tell us basically what you would do to me and make me scared. Bradley, you go first. I would cook you a dinner. Cook me yeah, dinner? Absolutely. I would put you in the shower. I'd be like fashion wrestler. I'd have like stiletto heels and I'd like, attack works. people with my heels. I would definitely be a good guy. I'd introduce you to my doll, soap you up. Condition your hair. Condition my hair? What's wrong with my hair? That looks great. Maybe we would take some sort of linguistic so class together. I'd grow out my nails. Maybe we'll go to church. Church? I'd be Archangel Michael. That's what I would be. And I would come in from the rafters. <laughs> Crazy orchestral music and stuff in <laughs> a choir. Peyton said that Jim Carrey and you had amazing energy together in this movie. Would you agree? Yeah, I mean, he, his energy is infectious. So I'd come on set and even if I was tired, his energy would always bring me up. We hit a couple of raves last night. It was totally off the hook. Yeah, you seem a little hyper. I had a couple of Red Bulls. Have you ever had a Red Bull? I never had a Red Bull before, but I had a Red Bull last night. I really like Red Bull. I got a new necklace. Close in the dark. But you can't really see it right now. I should do this. Your girlfriend, Jenny McCarthy, was yes. on the show, WWE. Right. If we could get both of you to come to WWE, say, in a tag team, possibly against William Regal and myself. Wow. Okay. I'll say yes, but I can't say about the timing. Oh, you can't? It could Why, be 10 years from now. Why, you scared you're not going to take me up on my challenge? Oh, wow. This you're is really bad now, challenge? but you go. So say me and you it have can a happen. match. It can it happen. It can happen. Okay, yeah. so I'm going to say, say me and you have a match against each other yeah. tomorrow night, okay? Yeah. Show me your WWE superstar impression. Okay, this, this is real. Okay, this isn't like cage fighting tonight, all right? This isn't like two dudes who walk in there with ketchup packets and graze each other and squirt ketchup on each other's face, and then you catch them backstage dipping fries into their wounds. No, this is real. This is WWE. You're scary. You know I am. But you have no yeah. idea what I can do. <laughs>
Yeah, I mean, yeah. Well, you, you know, the worst, the worst well, wrestlers are passive aggressive. Until tomorrow night, we'll be friends, okay? I'll oh. see you tomorrow night. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I thought just an exciting day here. I got to ride Jim Perry's scooter. I got to meet all the stars in Yes Man the movie. And now let's finish up with some dancing. I mean, Jim Perry did the dance, dance revolution in the movie. This is pretty good. I, I could probably do a better job than him.